My name is Jerry. I'm from Bonner Springs, Kansas, and my son Riker is the reason I found Jensen Law. So I'm from Kansas. I came out to Arizona on a whim because I was tired of working on the dock and it was cold and my bones hurt. So I was like, let's try Arizona. Came out with a girlfriend that I was with at the time. I loved Arizona. We traveled six months straight. Flagstaff, Prescott, Grand Canyon, stayed out of these places for weeks at a time, just exploring the town. That's what brought me here. This is hard. His mother and I, we were good up until the next day he was born. After the day he was born, she kind of just stopped communicating with me and I didn't have any time with my son. I didn't get to see him. She pretty much just withheld him from me and I was stressed. I had bags under my eyes. I was not sleeping. I was struggling at work. Like life as I knew it seized as soon as I found out I did not get to see my son and I was going to go to file with the court. I had called my mother and she had told me to not file yet because she had spoken with my aunt, Angela, and she said that if you had messed up one thing on those filing paperwork, that something traumatically wrong could happen and your son could lose time with his father. So I scratched that idea and I said, okay, I need a lawyer and I need a good one because my son needs a father. And eventually, my aunt called me, she said, hey, I found this law firm and it was Jensen Law and I had met Deborah and shoot, Deborah, she was, she was gun ho for me. She was like, oh, that baby needs his father. I was like, this is the one that I want for me. This is what my son needs is this fighter right here. This is who I want to go with. She was just like real positive about everything. Like she saw the things that I saw that needed to be addressed as to what was not okay about his son not having his father. She was just on it. From the time that I left the deposit with her, she was filing stuff for my son. Like she just did it. Like I didn't have to call to find out, hey Jerry, it's filed. We have court next week. What? She's like, yeah, we might, we might get to see your son next week. She executed it from the start. And then a year and a couple months after that, still executing, still just doing exactly as I requested. Whenever I needed to talk to Deborah, she was there, but always, always communication was done through the paralegal, which saved me a lot of money. The rest is history. I have my son. It was two or three weeks after he was born, and that following week we went to court, and I had my son the next Thursday, right then and there. I had my son again. I don't know how I could have pulled that off by myself doing any of it. I could focus purely on my son at that time because everything else had been taken care of with the courts. And I owe that to Genesis.